let's talk about aperture. So I think previously we talked about everything about photography is about the light. So it's a kind of a really similar and strongly connected with digital art, with art, with drawing, because it's all just a play with the light. Okay, so uh, what do I mean by that? Uh, let me use some of the technical terms and try to explain this to you. So first technical term you might encounter is called aperture, okay, or f-stop, or uh, yeah, or, or what is this, okay? So if you uh, look at your camera, okay, or if you um, uh, bought some like uh, uh, changeable lenses, all right, you can look at uh, what's inside. Okay, let me just uh, make this light. Uh, Okay, and I'm going to open this lens, and uh, hopefully you guys can see what's inside. Okay, uh, let me just uh, turn. Okay, uh, let me just get rid of this. Okay, this tiny little thing, it's like a shutter, right? Okay, this is called aperture. Let me, let me turn it down, maybe it's uh, too reflective. Yeah, 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 that thing, that thing. Okay, let me. Okay, it's just really hard for me to show you this thing. I want to do this alive so you, you, you know what's going on. Yeah, so we got this ho little hole that can let light coming through, and uh, I'm going to make it brighter. Yeah, that's called aperture. <laughs> okay, uh, okay, I give up. So basically, um. It's the thing that inside of your lenses. Okay, I got it. I just take off. Okay, I think this is a good angle. Hopefully you guys can, can see what's inside, okay? So basically, it's the adjustable um, mechanism that inside the lens is, okay? So they can change the size. Okay, so for example, um, you like you're taking a photo, the photo, like the light source, okay? So whatever photo you're taking, basically it's just the light source in real life. Like the light is coming from this way, okay? So all the way shine towards me, okay? And I'm a camera right now, and I got this aperture or f-stop, okay? Okay, stop showing this, uh, um, stop showing this heart, okay? I'm going to adjust the setting every time I like it. Doing this, you will just automatically got hot. I don't know what's going on. Maybe some default setting of the camera. Okay, I don't know what's going on, but it seems that I can't switch it off. And this, I think, is a very stupid design. Doesn't really matter. Let's go back. Um, let me adjust the lighting a little bit. Uh, so basically, the aperture is something. Yeah, let me add it. I can't switch off the light. Okay, so. Basically, it's an adjustable thing that's um, like this, okay, I don't know. Come on, I'm not going to trigger this. So basically, it's a, like a circle, okay? And this circle can change. The light, like, coming all the way to here. And I don't want to see this much light. So I will just become smaller. There's just some really tiny hole that the light can come through. And if... It's a really dark environment. Okay, I'm going to make a bigger. This is sort of like iris in your eye. Remember? So if you look at, uh, do you know why we think? By the way, this um completely irrelevant topic. But do you know why we think that wild animal, especially the like a cute little wild animal, is so cute? Because if you look at all the animal, especially the baby animal. Look at the, the eyes. Like there is a, like a completely dark. The whole eye just a, a dark sphere. That's because they're more sensitive than human eyes. Okay, so I know that humans uh, body anatomy is, is is great. We we sort of like a top of the food chain, but our physical scale. The uh, like sensitivity of light 
is not as good as um, we expected. Okay, so for example, the eyesight, we can't compare with, uh, say, eagle. Okay, and they got a pretty sensitive eye. But uh, let's go back to our video. So the eye can adjust that, adjust to the light that come through your eye. Okay, the iris can adjust that. So if you're like a, a lot of light coming, uh, the iris just becomes smaller. Okay, so you don't need to screen, but you can also see things. Uh, and if you want completely dark area, it just iris like a dilated a little bit. Okay, just become bigger, so it allow more light coming through. So in, inside the camera, the aperture is will also work like this. Okay, yeah, I think it's a perfect angle. Oh my gosh, that's a perfect angle. So you, as you can see, uh, we can sort of change the aperture uh, inside. Uh, I don't know whether I can change this manually, uh, but hey, it's working. Uh, you guys can see it. Okay, that, that, that's good. It's good enough for me. Yeah, and um, we got some mechanism inside of uh, lenses as well as camera. So you can use like auto mode, so they will change the aperture automatically. Or you can uh, like change them manually. Okay, this all depends on you or whatever settings you, that, that you have. And um, let me talk a little bit more about um, so-called f-stop. Okay, so if you look at the camera, the camera um i believe you can have a lot of settings like we got this um okay i don't seem to find this f stop sign here so yeah you can't find this on camera but um i believe if you like it um take a photo and uh bring out the you know, say the iphone or something like that and you scroll up look at the detail of that photo you can see that it's uh, using a specific lenses specific f-stop and the f-stop is something like this it's like a fraction uh, of number so f and divide it by a specific thing okay so maybe uh, 0 0.4 maybe 2 maybe 2.5 uh, 2.8 uh, 5.6 something like that the bigger the number the smaller the aperture Okay, because you know if you treat this as f divided by a number, so the bigger the number, the smaller the whole thing. So that's a it's kind of reversed, but uh, if you use a little bit of mathematic, you know what's going on. So you know that it's uh, using a really um, high f stop or low f stop, something like that. Yeah, so. Just the same thing, aperture, f-stop, yeah, um, just the same thing about describing the amounts of light that you allow um, the outside world shoot into your, whether it's a film, crystal, digital sensor, something like that, it's just some device that can record and capture the light, okay, yeah, that's all, and um, yeah, thanks, bye.